The Razorback is a wasteful weapon slot to use, makes your worst enemy stronger, and barely helps with spies. A much better alternative is the default SMG. The Razorback used to be one of the best weapon choices in competitive before its nerf, where you can't get overhealed because spies would kill you fast enough anyways in competitive that you can't swap to the SMG, so it wasn't a very big deal and you could use that second slot. Might as well wear it to waste an extra half second of their time. Now that you can't get overhealed with it on though, you might as well wear the SMG in case the spy messes up so you can take care of him. Your biggest problem is enemy snipers though, and bombers. Not being overhealed makes these players extremely dangerous too. Your health pool is very low and they can take you out almost immediately. Now, a lot of people don't play competitive, they just play casual, right? And casual, Razorback sadly is even worse. First off, Spies are terrible and casual, they just don't know how to play the game. Spy is an almost useless class due to Sniper doing his job better than him in every way, shape, and form, and the players picking him aren't trying to play their best anyways. 12 player teams also make Spy much more useless, because it's hard to even walk around without getting killed by random fire directed at someone else, or at least spotted. If by some slim chance they make it to you, as long as you're using a good pair of headphones, you can hear them walk up behind you, even if they're invisible. Then turn around and kill them with a random crit from your good old melee. The counter argument to this is you don't get overhealed often in casual. My response to that is that's true, unless you wear a fancy hat. Now, if you don't have a fancy hat, that means it has no downsides, right? That's false. The downside is that you can't use secondary weapons that are more effective than the Razorback. Speaking of better secondary weapons, what should you actually use? In competitive, just the SMG, and in casual, either the SMG, Jurati, or the Cozy Camper. In competitive, the only right choice is the SMG. This is because you need some way to defend yourself at medium and close range, which you don't have because random crits are disabled. In casual, close range can be covered by your melee weapon due to random crits being a bit OP, especially on sniper. This still means the SMG is a good choice for killing medium range enemies, but there are other options to deal with mid range enemies. Usually, it will come down to your sniper rifle if you don't use the SMG, which is why I like to use the Cozy Camper. The Cozy Camper allows the Machina to do its job, even while I'm being attacked. Because as long as you're fully charged, there's no weapon flinch. This lets you kill scouts, heavies, pyros, and other close range enemies that are attacking you, as long as you can aim well enough to at least body shot them at medium or close range. The Cozy Camper also helps deal with fire damage because it allows you to heal over time. Fire damage can be detrimental to snipers due to the scorch shot and because of aim punch. Basically, the Cozy Camper just gives you a weaker version of medic self-healing, which is very useful. Going from 1 healing a second all the way up to 4 healing per second when you haven't been damaged recently. Your last choice that's at least decent and casual is the Jurati. The Jurati is not very helpful to you other than being able to extinguish yourself, but it can be extremely helpful to your team. Sniper's weapons other than the SMG don't have damage fall off and can random crit or guaranteed crit anyways, so you don't need the Jurati's extra damage to help out or the removal of damage fall off to help out. But your team, they can use those things a lot. Say for instance the enemy team is pushing really fast and they're pretty close together. You throw your Jurati and hit three of them. Now your Heavy, who is very far away, can deal lethal damage to those three without even needing to get close because there's no damage fall off. Usually though, it turns into a, if I'm going down, I'm taking you with me weapon. I personally don't like the Jurati because it doesn't allow me to defend myself at medium range, even if it allows my team to help me more at medium range. This one thing I know is true. When in casual, assume everyone is an idiot except you. That way, if they aren't, you'll be pleasantly surprised. Better than your expectations. And if they are, you know you're alone in defending yourself. This will help you increase your skill faster and require you to be the best for you. Now that's all for this video. If you liked it, leave a like. If you disliked it, leave a dislike. If you really liked it, maybe hit the subscribe button. I post videos often here.